Tonight for Your Life, Your Health, a club that nobody wants to join, but they are grateful it exists. It's called the Zipper Club, a very exclusive group of folks who've gone through open heart surgery, leaving them with a scar like a zipper on their chest. New specialist Lori Pritchard shows us how this club is saving lives. I had about a 6% chance. They gave me about a 15% chance to live three weeks. Two men, both facing their own mortality after experiencing heart failure, but neither wanted to be a statistic. I was still in the hospital waiting for my donor, and he had just received his LVAD. Left ventricular assist device, a bridge to a transplant until a heart donor becomes available. That feeling is it's unlike any other feeling I've felt. The hopelessness, the dark spot that I was in my life. Brent reinstilled that hope. They found each other and answers to questions at the Zipper Club. Getting input from you guys has been invaluable. A community of heart failure patients meeting twice a month. This group helps people stay healthy because health goes beyond the physical. It goes into the emotional, psychological health as well. But Brent, who is the glue to this group, opened more than just his heart. He opened his home when Jake, who lives in Idaho Falls, needed to stay close to the hospital. I said, who better, because uh, I lived the program, and I would make sure that he got to the hospital, the clinic, when he needed to. But I think she wants it cut right to the color. Yeah, so that won't be hard. Brent also opened his business and gave Jake a job. Both have new hearts now, and Jake will go home soon to his Idaho family, but will forever be grateful for his heart family. There's a beat in my heart that beats for them and a beat in my heart that beats for my family. Lori Pritchard, KSL 5 News. Thanks, Lori. Jake says he plans to continue helping other heart patients in Idaho Falls. Intermountain Healthcare also plans to launch a pilot program in St. George, partnering with two national support group organizations. For